So what's there to say about the passing of Jean-Luc Godard? Um, from my perspective, he's a filmmaker who really wasn't the first or the only one, but he made movie watching something more than passive entertainment and infused his deep immersion and intellectual grasp of the art form uh, into a body of work that I think is still ahead of its time. Uh, he grew up watching commercial cinema from the USA um, and viewing it from a unique angle that has influenced many watchers as well as filmmakers over the years, ever since, including myself. And uh, he is definitely one of my most esteemed directors, somebody who I believe, uh, you know, has a an outsized impact um, on on the world of cinema and really on the 20th century and uh, its legacy as as a cultural uh, treasure trove, uh, documenting not just the beauties but also the horrors of that century and opening our eyes to see what's happening in the world around us right now. So yeah, I am uh, personally affected by the fact that he's no longer with us. It just feels like, you know, the art of cinema has lost a, a titan and it's closed a chapter that uh, can't be rewritten or started over again. It's a transitional figure who opened up new vistas for movie watchers and movie makers all around the world. As I look at these titles, I've written about them, podcasted about quite a few of them. And um, yeah, they've been life-changing for me. Earl LeFou was in particular. Um, it's a landmark movie for me. It's, it's one that uh, hit me at a particular point in life. And kind of changed my outlook on a lot of things. And kind of got me into this phase of where I'm at right now. Uh, last year I did a series of podcasts about these films and those right before it. And of Godard's political radical phase, underappreciated, perhaps undiscovered by many people who I think would benefit from a familiarity. And that wasn't the end. He kept going. These films are kind of evidence of that. There's several from this era that I don't have in my collection yet that I haven't seen yet. But I will continue my study. And again, my respect and gratitude to Jean-Luc Godard.